Hey everyone, welcome back to another Fortnite Save the World video. In this video, I will tell you everything you need to know about the wall darts trap. Where to use it, how to use it, best perks, should you supercharge it, and more. A lot of people ask me for a video to explain all the traps in the game. But it will be simpler to make a video about each trap. Don't worry, it won't be very long videos, it will try to shorten them as much I can. This video will be the start of a full playlist for all the traps in the game. A lot of work I know, but I'm sure it's worth it. Before we start, don't forget to like and subscribe if you are enjoying the content, helps me a lot. And you can become a member too. And without further ado, let's get started. Wall darts. One of the best traps in the game right now, and the best wall trap. But before we dive into the video, let me show you why it is that good. And don't worry, I will explain everything in details plus examples to make sure you understand everything. 1. It's the only wall trap that has more than one tile range, it has three tiles range. For example, when you place a trap here, anything pass in front of it within three tiles range, will get hit. Which makes this trap very good to cover open areas. And for tunnel with two or three tiles wide. 2. Its reload time is very low, compared to the other damage wall traps. I will explain the rest while showing you where to use it. This applies for the normal missions, endurance and storm shield defenses. Now let me show where and how to use this trap. It may sound silly for you, but believe me, for someone who's still learning the game, I need to show everything, so bear with me for a moment. Let's start with a simple example where all you need is just to place the trap. Let's say you are in a mission or build some tunnels for endurance. You know where the spawn location is and when the husk will walk. So you built a tunnel, and you need to add damage traps to eliminate the husk passing through your tunnel. Simply you can just add your traps on the walls, but it's different with wall darts, let me show you. As I mentioned before, wall darts trap has 3 tiles range. So I can edit my tunnel to 2 tiles, tunnel, even 3. Let me show you. You can edit this wall like this, or this, and add another wall behind like this. And the trap will be able to shoot through all of these kind of edits. Now you have a 2 tiles tunnel. The husk will go through this tile, but it will be 3 wall traps damaging to them instead of 2. And you can make a triple tiles tunnel like this. And now you have 4 wall traps damaging the husk instead of 2. Don't worry about the tunnel design, I will explain that later in another video. It's amazing how many traps you can combine to damage one tile. For example, I already have 4 wall traps damaging this tiles, and I can add 3 roof traps to damage the same tile. I will use gas trap here for example. An electric field trap on the outside roofs. I will make a separate video about all of them don't worry. Now let me show you few examples. Here I have a 1 covering 2 tiles. I have a sound wall traps on these walls, but I edited the walls to windows, so I can use wall darts traps behind them. So I have both traps covering this tile, recycle and damage traps. Here I have 3 tiles wide tunnel. This one covering 3 tiles. You should know now how this trap works and where to use it. Now, for the best perks. You can use any perks you like, but for me, these are the best perks you can use for every situation. As you will see later on, for some traps you need a different combination of perks for different situations. But for this trap, this combination works for everything. You can't change the element, only physical, but still, the damage is very good. Critical rating, crit damage, damage and reload. You can use double critical rating and crit damage. But for me, single is enough, I prefer reload speed. And as you see, the reload time is only 4.2 seconds, which is insane. Plus the critical rating chance is 38%, which is very decent. You can use double critical rating and crit damage if you want. I will make a video explaining the difference between them and how they work. For the last perk, use durability. Better than the other perks, because with 4.2 seconds reload time, you will need a lot of durability. Now should you supercharge it? Of course. Damage traps always worth supercharging. One thing I forgot to mention is wall darts trap can shoot through ramps like this one. But if you combined it with edited wall like this, it won't shoot. 
Also, it shoot through ramps like this. But it won't be efficient like this. A lot to say about this trap, but these are the most important information you need to know. I know that this video may sound weird for some of you, since this trap is in the game for years and most of us know everything about it, but a lot of people asked for it so here we are. Plus it will help the new players a lot to understand the game. And that's it, don't forget to use code LARSIS in the item shop if you want to support me. Let me know in the comments what do you think about this kind of videos, and which trap you want to see next. This is a gameplay clip from Endurance showing how this trap works, I showed this amp specifically since I used a lot of wall guards traps while building it. Hope you enjoyed the video, and as always, see you in the next one.